Sarah, what happened? <laughs> I don't know. I made the mistake of coming to a developer conference, unfortunately. No, I think, honestly, like, I talked to the Q McLeod from, I think it was Hugh McLeod, uh, from South by Southwest Support, and he said, don't do a QA, and a and then there were people lining up at the microphones. Like, they've admitted they've never had anyone as big as Mark before. Yeah. Someone like Mark doesn't talk about APIs. He talks about company strategy. And honestly, I think it was a weird fit for the audience. It's just that thing is, a core group of people in the back of the room got so angry that they basically probably ruined South by Southwest for getting people that high profile again, which is a little unfortunate. But a lot of people said they got a lot out of it, and frankly, we broke a lot of news. So I feel fine about it as a journalist. But they weren't rough on him, so why would, why would they have trouble getting people? He, well, he was pretty upset by what I mean, um. he thought it was... I mean, it was, we both felt really great, and we discussed what we were going to talk about beforehand, so while there were my questions, like, we had said this would be cool to talk about, people are going to be interested in this, so I'm the fall guy, but he definitely didn't have fun. I mean, I was some reports saying, like, he was on the other side of it, like, he and I were both looking at each other, like, the whole audience is laughing and with us for 48 minutes, and then, like, everyone turns, and we were like, what happened? So, well, I saw your Twitter. You're like, screw everybody. Were you, were you kind of joking around? Or are you I mean, somewhat, but it's like, honestly, when you're in my business, like, I'm one of the only women reporting on tech. I get this constantly. Like, read any blog comment about me. I get this constantly. Guess what? I'm still employed. Obviously, some people enjoy what I do, so. Well, what, what were you saying earlier about your Amazon rank? Yeah, I mean, I've had, like, more than 100 people start following me. My Amazon rank is higher than ever. Like, they're obviously not all people who think I'm an app. Were you, like, the most Googled person between, like, <laughs> You know what? It's happened before, honestly. Like, I've had way worse on a massive scale written about me before, and it, it blows over. It's living, it's the reality of living in this realm, and it's the price of being high profile, unfortunately. And, you know, not to understate it, because, like, most people who do it don't realize how it hurts when you publicly attack someone who's, try, frankly, trying to do their job. I mean, honestly, I, I felt great about how it went. I asked them a range of things, and there's a huge number of constituencies when you talk about someone like Mark. Mainstream press expects you to break news. People in the room want to hear stuff. I think we touched on a lot of things, and, you know, I'd like to see someone else try it. It's not as easy as it looks.